unusual city is Hollywood, California, thrill and glamour capital of the world. Beauty is old stuff in Hollywood. Only the tourists turn their heads for movie stars. Those in the know always point out one building, home of the Hollywood stuntman. When this telephone rings, there's an airplane to be smashed, a car to be driven over a cliff. Good morning, Goldilocks. Good morning. How's the arm? Oh, it's okay. Anything new? They still want that jump stunt. Anything else? Why, yes. A tire company back east wants you to put two of their tires on one side of a car, any other new tires on the other, and then drive at high speed on a wet pavement and jam on the brakes. It's a sort of test. What? Roll the car over? No, that's all. That's all? That's what it says. And I get paid for that? Okay. When do I start? Monday afternoon. It's their money. Yes, and it's your next. Uh. What's the dope? Well, this car has two ordinary conventional tread tires on one side. And on the other, there are two fist safety flight tires. And we want to test these tires thoroughly. The first test is to drive... I know, I know. On the wet pavement and slam on the brakes. <laughs> Wait. Okay. <laughs> I got that. We have a fleet of test cars. But none of our men want to try the job because they're afraid the safety flight will hold so much better that the car will do a tailspin. Oh. Uh, I've been driving test cars for years. And I doubt if there's that much difference in tires. Let's try it. <laughs> All right, if you're ready. All right, officer. Surprise. Boy, I never felt a tire grab the way that one did. They held just like that. The other side kept right on going. What's the business here? That tire is different than any tire you ever drove before. Yeah, I found that out. You see these transverse inserts? You mean those white things? Well, we call them inserts. They're made of a special soft but very tough white rubber. They divide the tread ribs into hundreds of flexible individual blocks of rubber, each one acting independently of the other just as if they were actually separate. I, I don't get it. Well, I'll show you. Now, if I put the hard end of the pencil on paper and push it forward, it goes quite easily. But if I do it like this, it's a different story because the eraser end is flexible. It digs in, doesn't want to move. The tread of most tires is hard and unyielding. That's why it can't grip the roads as the flexible blocks can, which go to make up the safety flight tread. Ah, now I get it. Taken years of research to develop this tire. Let me show you the features which go to make this tire so completely different. Now, in the first place, if you look inside at an end view of the cords in a tire, this is the ideal way to have them. But the old way wove a cross thread in like this. When the rubber was forced in around the cords, it's distributed unevenly. The threads interfere with perfect insulation. Now, here's a piece of ordinary cord fabric. You can see the uneven surface. And the threads tend to break and chafe, create internal heat. Fisk engineers found a way to eliminate the cross threads. And here it is. Nothing to interfere with the proper insulation of each cord. And at 40 miles an hour, by test, tires made of this cord run 15% cooler. Then there's a special bead lockup that works like this. The object is to eliminate the stiff area around the bead. The Fisk bead lockup permits a gradual change from the firm bead to the flexible sidewall. You can see its action this way. The conventional bead construction sets up a pronounced hinging like this. 
setting up heat and tending to break down the sidewall. Fisk engineers have built this new sidewall so that it tends to bend in a full arc without a lot of hinging, reducing the danger of blowouts. One reason why this is possible is that the tread is built so that the outer edge is directly above and within the rim flange. Rim width, they call it. And there are no overhanging shoulders, which in many tires tend to reduce this flexing area. You see, this tire rolls on seven deep ribs in continuous contact with the pavement. That means low resistance, quiet, smooth rolling. This seven rib tread design makes it almost impossible to skid sideways. When you go to start and stop, each one of these little blocks tips and goes to work. Now suppose for a second that you just had the blocks, no inserts. You'd get a bite on the pavement, but uh, the dirt would get in. And they'd tend to tear and chip and wear smooth, so that you'll have to have the tire recut. So that's why Fisk has developed this highly elastic insert of tough white rubber. Also, the uh, insert goes all the way down below the ribs, so that the non-skid efficiency is retained as the tire wears down. Look here. The minute I put a strain on this strip of rib, the softer white inserts permit the harder blocks to work freely, as if there were nothing between. Each one digging in and getting traction, that would be impossible with a conventional tire. That's why the Fisk Safety Flight Tire is America's safest tire. It stops you in a straight line, it takes you safely around wet curves. I'd like to try a car with four of them. That's what we're going to do right now. You take your car with ordinary tires, and I'll take this one. With safety flights all the way around. And let's see the difference. You take my car and let me have that one. <laughs> okay. Your stop was fully 20 feet shorter than the previous test. I never drove anything like this. They give you real road control, don't they? Yes, and ride like a million dollars. No rumble or noise. I want a set of these babies. Will you take a trip with them? I find I make better time and use less gas doing it. Uh-huh. Jerry, with a set of these tires, I'll do that jump stunt I was worrying about. Oh, Mike, be careful. Maybe you'd like to come along. Well, yes, I'd like to. Just what is it? You might get a kick out of it. It's a stunt for a movie. I double for the leading man. He's supposed to drive a car off the road and jump over a row of cars. Jump over a row of cars? Yes. <laughs> Here's the way it goes. Different from any tire heretofore offered motorists, the Fisk Safety Flight combines the silence and low rolling resistance of its seven rib tread design with astonishing traction qualities which offer faster, more restful motoring with an entirely new sense of security. Mm -hmm. 